There's something about that feeling of sitting down knowing you're about to hop into a masterpiece. What's up guys and welcome to Horizon Forbidden West. My goodness, it's been a long time coming. I can't wait to see what Aloy's been up to. Can't wait to hop into this story with you all and uh, yeah, it's gonna be great. Brand new series here on the channel. Always exciting. Let's hop into it. I believe this picks up right where uh, Zero Dawn left off. Gonna be honest, it's been a while since I've played it, so we've got some catching up to do, but um, Zero Dawn was incredible. I'm sure this is gonna be just as, if not more so. of a terraforming system that's spiraling out of control. And only I can fix it. Only I have your genetic code. It won't be long before we hit the point of no return. And then, extinction. I've been searching for months for what I need. A backup of Gaia, the AI you designed to control the system. Aloy's our only hope. Night, I have the same dream. I'm walking under a brilliant night sky, through a field of flowers. And when I arrive at the center, I see you, Elizabeth. Waiting for me, even though you've been dead for a thousand years. You're the closest person I've ever had to a mother. And for a moment, I feel whole. one of those dreams where you punch and you're in like slow-mo you guys ever have those when you can't like defend yourself I'm always left alone this world is your legacy Elizabeth I won't let it slip away. The valley below is my only remaining lead. My last hope to find the backup. I'll do whatever it takes to get it. I promise. God, this looks so good. Varl? <laughs> If it isn't Aloy, the savior of Meridian, anointed of the Nora. You know I hate being called that stuff. Well, consider it a punishment for running out on us the very same night we beat Hades. I grew up an outcast. Remember, I'm not much for parties. Yeah. But that one was in your honor. Just saying. So, 
What are we doing? Must be urgent since you left so fast. Delving into ancient ruins? Or maybe it has something to do with the Blight. Both, actually, but, um... I, I should... Oh, no. I've been dragging you a long way. <laughs> it's okay. After everything you've done to help Lenora and my family, I swore an oath to help you, no matter what. But you're stuck with me now. Like bark on wood. <laughs> I like that. Okay, but if you're going to come with me, you'll need to be able to see what I see. <sighs> A focus? Never thought I'd get your second sight. I'll give you another one later and show you how to back up your data. Data? Information on the device. We've got a lot to cover. Um, I'll have to explain everything as we go. You see like this all the time? Since I was a little girl. Come on. So long story short, if you guys don't remember the first game, or you didn't watch the series, didn't play it, whatever. Basically in the 20th century, things kind of hit the fan. There were wars, climate change. The world was basically dying. Shall we? Gaia is this like robot program. It's like a nine tiered program with different things that control the weather and control terraforming and control repopulation and stuff like that. Um, the scientist created Gaia and then right. she also made a clone of herself. Scrapes on the way here. We should find some medicinal plants. Stock up. So it's time for your first lesson with the focus. Sounds good. Let's get started. The clone was the backup in case everything went to shit and like, you know, everything failed. That backup is Aloy. So then thousands of like years the later, Aloy's the born. She's the only the key to be able to save the world. The we need. Okay, so. Focus there. pulse with R3. Those plants by the stream should do the trick. Beautiful. Pick all these guys up. Gonna try to get as many berries as possible here. If I've ever learned anything, it's to check out behind the waterfall in video games. Maybe we're a little bit too... too early on for that. Those ruins. That's where we need to go. Okay. I don't know Might as well. Here, but we can use the line to slide down. Take the fast way, huh? <laughs> Salvaging machine carcasses as usual. And there they go. Looks like they left a carcass behind. Dude, this world is just so beautiful. Look at how green the greens are. Holy cow. Down we go here. A lot of arrows in that machine. Better take a closer look. Someone took down this machine recently. Who else would come here? I don't know. We better craft some arrows of our own. There might be trouble up ahead. There's some ridgewood by the stream. Ah, I see it over here. Beautiful. Come grab this stuff. All it's right. all about the materials and crafting. Craft some arrows. I want to open up our weapon wheel. We're gonna go here. We can craft some arrows. Done. Beautiful. Me too. Arrows ready. 
Grab some more while we're here, just in case. Looks like we've got some health over yonder as well. Grab this. There it is. There's a ladder. But can't reach it from here. Nothing a well-placed arrow can't knock free. Just have to target the lock. After you. Beautiful. Is anybody out here? It looks kind of making me a little bit nervous. Here we go. What was this place? I don't know. The transmission. The uh, message I found. We need to find a way in. The blight's not just poisoning plants. It's killing animals too. It's so sad. Then people will get sick too, and starve. We're not gonna let that happen. Gold thorn pepper. Not sure what we're going to be able to use that for, but I'll take it. Grab some of this wood as well. Entrance going to be over this way. This game is just so beautiful. We're playing in uh, performance mode. Get 60 FPS. There's also a... Get to the grass. Graphics mode, but... Never seen one of those before. Got a weak spot in his butt and his face. The machines have it on alert. How do you want to handle it? The focus can help us. We can scan the machine before we make our move. Okay. Okay. See how parts of it are glowing? It's eye. Those are its weak it's spots. It's a weak spot. Yep. Right. Alright. Okay, concentrate. YOLO! We need the ability that that slows down time. Here we go. Got him. Search the burrower. Take them all. Good? Beautiful. A few supplies. More dead machines. Ooh. There's an ability where you can slow down time when you aim down sight like this. Woo! Nicely done. How does the focus know all that? It reads data on the machine. Like a hunter studying its prey? Yeah, kind of. <laughs> so after the fuss over me leaving, what did everyone else do? Well, as soon as the celebration was over, my mother led the rest of the Nora home. The Sun King put his people to work rebuilding the city. And I set out to find you. Well, I can appreciate that. Got it. Looking out for me, coming to help out. I did, I've heard, I, I've so watched some reviews. Too. The first one, you were pretty much on your own the whole time. This one, I think there's a little bit more focus on yeah. working together. Yeah, my first one when I found to a ruin. Got the others from an old cache not long ago. That's good to have extras. Keep on going. Welcome to the Far Zenith launch facility. Far Zenith? I, I know they made some tech trades with Zero Dawn, but why would they have a backup of Gaia? Please register with reception for the tour. I guess they want us to check in with them. I should be able to pry this open. Somebody's been here. There's climbing gear. I guess someone dropped in from above. Whoever left us here might have also shot those machines we found earlier. So where are they now? I'll give you one guess. Ugh. What's that stench? Up here in front of us. Entire camp. Wiped out. They must have come here to delve for scrap. Acid. That explains the smell. And it looks like something big came in from above. Crashed right through the camp. And then through the wall. 
I should take a look at the rubble in that gap. Okay. See if we can blow this open somehow. Whatever came through here brought this down as it went out. If I can dislodge some of the debris, we might be able to squeeze through. Maybe I can find something to help in the camp. Aloy, over here. I think I got something. It's some kind of Osram prototype, I think. This hook looks like it can latch onto things. Grappling hook! And this gear pulls it back. Hmm. It looks broken, but maybe we can repair it. Hook it to the debris. And pull it out. That could work. The focus can help us search the camp and identify anything we can use to fix the tool. My focus picked up a couple of things to check out. Alright. Head right over yonder. Acid burned right through his armor. Part of a machine could help fix the gears. Got a practice thingy here. Can I break this and end up getting some fr something from it? Come on. That guy. <laughs> Should at least be an achievement or something, right? Looks like we've got something over this way. Machine cable. Stronger than rope. All right, ah. I think I have what I need to repair the tool. Or maybe even make something better. You could use this workbench. Here we go. The pull caster, an improved version of a Delver's prototype tool that can latch on onto and pull objects, also enables grappling to specific points. Beautiful. Got our first piece of equipment. There. Uh, pull caster. Now to test it on the debris. Come over here. Come on, baby. Keep pulling, Aloy. Nice. Maybe pull this side a little bit. That works okay. better than I thought. Well, it doesn't look like there's an easy way out of here. I should scan the area. We have to find a way to keep going. What's this? Huh. What's this thing for? Try to find out. Whoa. Good morning. I'm Oswald Dalgard, and it is my pleasure to introduce you to Far Zenith. Forget what you think you know about us. Our truth is simple. <laughs> We say reach for the stars, even if you have to cross 8.6 light years of space oh, to get there. I might be able to get up there. Jump and tab X for grapple points. That's nice and convenient. Wow, that works. That pull caster is useful. Too bad there's only one. Don't worry, I'll find you another way up. Okay, we'll figure it out, buddy. Don't you worry. Come up top here. That's a grapple point. Grapple to this and then go left. Beautifully done. I'm moving, tap L3 to sprint, tap X for a long jump. Hup! Almost didn't make that. Okay, I gotta drop the ladder for Varl. And we made it. First puzzle complete. There you go, Varl. Thanks. Let's go get this thing open. Humans, Homo sapiens, us. We have always pushed the boundary as explorers, pioneers, trailblazers. And now Far Zenith is taking the next leap into the future. That's why we're proud to have resurrected the Odyssey. 
When our government's abandoned in orbit, Far Zenith will actualize in less than a decade. But that's only the beginning. When the ship is complete, we will send the Odyssey and her crew where no one's gone before. <laughs> Well, this is pretty cool. The serious system. There, we'll create humanity's first off-world colony. See, everyone was trying to get off the world because it was it was dying. The Odyssey may take three hundred years to reach it, <sighs> but when we look up at the night sky, we'll know they're on their way. And in the words of our founder, the late Peter Chimbumbe. The truest form of immortality is data corrupt. The playback stopped. <laughs> the old ones could fly through the sky? Between the stars? Uh, well, yes, sort of. That ship, the Odyssey, it, it never made it to the other star. Something went wrong and it blew up. Can you imagine that? Three to four generations of people living on a spaceship before you even got to your destination? Insane. Is that why Elizabeth gave them a backup of Gaia? For a colony? Oh, they'll be able to set it up on the new Error. planet. Public presentation file corrupted. Member recruitment file available. Do you wish to reactivate? Yeah, reactivate. Let's see what else they had to say. We all know the projections. Economic instability, new biocontagions, rampant AIs. This isn't far from our future. The catastrophe creates unacceptable risk for the world's elite. We here at Far Zenith believe escape the inevitable. And so we reach for the stars. Now you've seen what we're building here. Infrastructure to support the Odyssey's construction. A state-of-the-art data center to facilitate rapid technological advancements. And you've seen how we're managing public perception. So invest and join us. Claim your birth on the Odyssey. Preserve your way of life beyond the concerns of Earth. Well, they were right about the world ending. They just didn't know how. Yet. So everything they said back there about the next step for humanity, it was all a lie. These people only cared about saving their own skin. Yeah, well, didn't work out for them in the end. That Oswald guy mentioned a data center. There, the backup. It should be stored in there. Won't be able to swim across. I guess we'll have to find a way around. Come on. Mm. So there's just a bunch of rich a-holes trying to save their butts. Trying to escape Earth. If you had enough money, you could buy your seat. really grown over this place. Gonna be able to break through this. Nice. Deeper into the creepy ruin we go. What, what is that? Is that Onyx? Keep your guard up. I don't think we want to mess with that. Here. Oh. Careful. Don't want those things to call in some friends from underground. <laughs> you take the left one. I'll deal with the one on the right. Okay. A little stealth action. Gotta love that. Make things a bit easier for us. Moving up. 
need to sneak up on it to take it out with my spear. Can't let it see me. I should scan it first. Detect his Check path. path. Highlight his track. Nice. So it's gonna stay out for us now. I can throw a rock to distract it. Get it into a position where I can sneak up and strike. You gonna go check that out, buddy? Dude, they're kind of like little gophers or something. They like stand up or little groundhogs. You do yours? Looks like he got his as well. Mine's down too. Beautiful. I'm gonna go loot yours if you don't mind. Let's maybe get up there, Aloy, or no? Go out and around. Don't mind if I do. Gotta make sure you always grab the resources, my man. More of those machines ahead. Nothing you and I can't handle. Coming this way. Right through the head, baby. Got another one over here. Let's try to see his track again. Assuming he's gonna come walking by us over here. Oh no, he just goes straight back and forth. He goes down and then comes back up. Dude, this would be so terrifying. So these machines, they, they run off of like biofuel. So like humans, like human remains and stuff. Like that they were they were created that way. That's the resource that they use, which is kind of crazy. Genetically engineered to be able to absolutely kick kick our asses. Okay. Got another one here. Don't even gotta do all that, baby. Let's just run up on them and get them. Beautiful. I've been meaning to mention. I noticed you have a new look these days. <laughs> yeah, I know. Didn't have a lot of time to shave when I was trying to catch up to you. Don't worry, it's not permanent. Good. Sorry, my whiskers offend you, anointed. I mean, I think it looks pretty good, man. I, I like the beard look. I respect it. Looks like this little guy got caught up in the blight. I couldn't escape. I hope it didn't suffer long. We keep heading this way. Now the campfire. Whoever came through here first. Can't be that far ahead. The Osram must have used explosives against the machines. They managed Looks to get like a couple. There was a barricade here. The machines must have broken through. The two burrows we can search. Beautiful. I'll keep this for later. Poisons? Guess that Osram didn't have a chance to use it. Careful. Traps ahead. Huh. Might be able to disarm them. There. Managed to salvage some supplies. Dismantle not it. blow yourself up. And got more supplies. Nicely done. Looks like another camp. While we're here, maybe we can make some traps of our own. Might come in handy against machines. Good idea. Okay, craft the blast trap, hold down to open your hunter's kit and then navigate to the blast oh, trap. Right supplies to craft a trap. We're gonna need blast and paste. Looks like the Osram shot off some machine parts. And we machine might be able to muscle. Scrounge up enough materials from there. Hmm. Resource container, there's I some blast paste. This. That's what I'm talking about. See if we got anything here. Okay. There's two more. Should have what I need to craft a trap. Actually got enough to craft two of these now. There. Explosive trap made. If anything walks into one of those, it won't know what hit it. <laughs> That's the idea. Over here. Aloy. I think I see a way up. <laughs> oh. 
machines ahead. Don't think they spotted us. I've seen this machine before. Scrounger. Scrounger. That's new to me. Let's see where its weak points are. Maybe we could place one of those traps you made in its path. We got a stealth kill. We're good. I'm not totally against just saving our blast traps. I was going to set it down, but he came over here, so why not, right? I don't think these are guys we're going to want to mess with otherwise. Whoo! I wasn't sure if he was going to turn and see us there, but we got him. Let's go. Let's keep going then. Um, Crouch is on square. I haven't, I haven't, I mean, obviously I haven't played Horizon in a while, so it, a lot of it's just, world ruins. I keep pressing circle when Are I want to like crouch. They all have their secrets, but every place is different. Got to have something up here, I would imagine. I don't know if this is where we're going, but there's definitely going to be loot. Whoa. That machine we saw earlier must be on the move. Let's hope it doesn't come this way. Oh. Looks like this is our objective. Might be leaving some loot behind, but that's all right. We'll survive. That's a big storm picking up out there. Yeah. They're getting stronger. And more frequent. So the storms, the blighted lands, the rivers and lakes choked with algae. You were born to fix all that? Yeah, but I can only do it if I find that backup. I think we're winding our way around to the data center. We'll need to cut through that big building on the right out there. Hey, Varl. There's data here. You scan it with your focus. Ah. Mm. This data mentions the tech that Farzina traded with Zero Dawn. It doesn't explain how they got a backup. I'll keep an eye out for more data. Scan those as we can. Let's see. Huh. A lot of glyphs. I'll tuck this away to study later. Looks like we've got to climb up. When in doubt, look up, baby. It's kind of the same theme of falling apart. Dying light. Well, it is a thousand years old. Coming. Looks like some kind of meeting room. That door on the other side's locked. There's another one. Onzu. The Zero Dawn terraforming system. There it is. The brainchild of Dr. Gaia. Elizabeth Sobek. Empowered by nine subordinate functions, Gaia, the core of the system, is capable of advanced planetary engineering, an obvious advantage to our space colonization efforts. Operation Phase 1. Establish an asset within Project Zero Dawn. Status complete. Phase 2. The asset will secretly beamcast a complete copy of Gaia and her subordinate functions to this facility's data center. That's where we need if to go. As well, Zero Dawn staff will remain completely unaware of the transmission. Risks. Discovery of this operation could result in Zero Dawn withholding the already negotiated Apollo database. Special care must be taken not to alert Travis Tate, the expert hacker in charge of Hades protocol. In addition, extreme caution must be exercised in regards to Dr. Sobek herself. As one of the world's preeminent technologists, she may have instituted unforeseen security measures. She did. A complete assessment is attached. This concludes the executive summary. Dirty. I thought Elizabeth sent the backup here, but she didn't. Far Zenith stole Gaia. Aloy, why does that woman look like you? That's my mom. Uh, um, it's okay, Paul. We look alike because we're the exact same, genetically identical. But she was one of the old ones. How can you be her? 
Because I wasn't born. I was made by a machine. It's why I'm motherless, why I was cast out as an infant. I don't understand. What kind of machine can make a person? Remember when I said the backup is like a set of instructions? It's more than that. It's called Gaia. And for a long time, she cared for the world until she had to destroy herself. So she made me to bring her back. I'm the only one who can. And this place is my last hope. And if we don't, we all die. You once said the goddess spoke to you when you went into All Mother Mountain. Was that this Gaia? Yes, but she's not the goddess, Laurel. There isn't one. How can you be sure? It sounds like she anointed you with a sacred task. <sighs> I've had a lot of time to figure this out. And you will too, with the focus. But for now... The report said they were going to store the stolen copy of Gaia in the data center. So that's where we have to go. Okay? Man. Imagine being thrust into this world. Oh yeah, I wasn't... Not actually a human, I was made by a machine, bro. By the, the you know... Super... Huh. Smart, advanced Look civilization that. that lived thousands of years hey, before us. Over here. I found something you could use. What's up? A weapon. Thanks, Varl. We should keep moving. After you. Okay. Frost blasting ling? Blastlings launch bombs that affect large areas. Weapon fires frost bombs. Use them against enemies to build up brittle state. Sweet. Little ice slingshot, I guess. Gotta keep it moving. Down here. Ooh. I think we're almost back outside. Good. There it is. Direction we're going. Great. A giant snake. Okay. Well, this is gonna be fun. Okay. So we're gonna put our frost blastling on here. Damage to it while it's brittle. Run. Come on, baby. Already brittle, Aloy. Ah! Woo! Okay. He's hurting. One hit should do it. Let's go. It's gonna be nice, especially against higher profile enemies. Looks like we can cross over here. Ground your power cell. More of the awesome delvers. And a lot of us. That big machine must have attacked as they tried to escape. They didn't stand a chance. Hmm. I'm assuming we don't want to just drop. I guess we can jump over here. So, you said this backup is the last hope. Yeah. All those places I've been these last few months, there were supposed to be more backups. But a thousand years ago, a guy named Ted Farrell purged them all. Was he part of Far Zenith too? No. He was worse. He was building them for his own personal gain. He was militarizing these machines, and that's kind of where things started to go wrong. Get up top here. Like we want to go this way. That's a grapple point. All right, I'll trust you. Beautiful. That thing's obviously going to be pretty useful. 
Not really sure how far we can jump. I don't know how to judge it yet, but we got it. Okay. I think eventually we're going to be able to climb pretty much anything we want. It's not like a free form like a Zelda, but most everything, like an Assassin's Creed, you can climb. Imagine going up to the stars in that. Awesome. Machines tore right through them. These guys couldn't catch a break. Hopefully we're gonna be able Machines to stand up to what ahead. they couldn't. We can tag them in the focus to keep track of them. Alright. So let's get into focus mode here. We're gonna tag. And tag. Sneaky Another one over there. Not gonna see us over there. Beautiful. Let me run this way. He's gonna scan. He's not gonna see anything. Oh my goodness, dude. Got him! <laughs> so sick. I mean, we can't take these guys on straight up. What's up, my man? How you doing? Here we go. Just gonna churn and burn, baby. Try to hit some of the weak spots. He's done. Look at that. Don't have to straight sneak on everyone. But it's kind of fun. I like it. Machine ripped right through the wall. There's a ladder in the back. Wonder if there's gonna be stuff back here we can grab. Oh yeah. He was kinda guarding something back here, I feel like. What's in here? I feel like there's gotta be something else. Maybe look up. No? Nothing, okay. Keep going, we're gonna have to uh craft some arrows. That first arrow that got stuck in the ladder. So tell me something. Sona was really okay with you not going back to the sacred lands? As the Nora war chief, she understood why I was obligated to follow you. But as my mother, she wasn't pleased. <laughs> Is she ever pleased? I don't think I've seen her smile. Me neither. It's all right. You're going to make mama proud. Don't you worry, bro. We're gonna save the world one day at a time. Love these cutscenes that are instant. Oh, there's two of them? Three of them? Three of those things. And if they slaughtered all those Osirum, we'll never get through to the data center. We're gonna have to sneak. There's no way to slip past them. Too tough to fight head on. We're not. We could find a settlement. Convince some hunters to help us. Go up. That up and around. Weeks, and we don't have that kind of time. Maybe all we need is that shuttle to fall. <laughs> that thing? How? We'll figure it out. Just wait here. <laughs> Aloy. Trust me. And there she goes. All right. Just need to get open. <laughs> Dude, she is just so sick. I love it. All right. Looks like we've got some more enemies in front of us here. They should be able to find a way across to the shuttle. This guy looks awfully big for a silent strike, but it looks like we can get him in one. I don't know. It's just a big-looking burrower. There's somebody else over here, right? You heard something? I ain't hear nothing. A little concerned. I'm gonna tag him. Everything's good here, bro. Don't you worry. 
And now it's my turn to strike. Maybe I should stick to my spear for now. <laughs> well, one of them saw me, but I I got the other one at least. Woo! 90 to the face. Okay. He's dead. Fantastic. Gotta love that. Is there something up here? No? I feel like exploring off the beaten path is gonna be really important in this game just to kinda make sure we're always kitted up. See, like this. Beautiful. We make sure we always have resources for health, for arrows, for everything else. Okay. Do you believe we're gonna have to go up? And it looks like there. this might be the way. That ladder can get me up to the tower. I feel like we could have reached that. I feel like we definitely could have reached that instead of wasting an arrow, but we're good. It if I launch myself off that grapple point. Got it. Sick. Okay. New move there. Be able to launch ourselves up. These do something. Oh wow. Well, that sounds good. Hold on a second. I don't want to miss anything here. Bet there was something downstairs too. Yeah, of course there was. Leave no stone. Oh, there are two things down here. No stone unturned. Dude, the movements, the physics, the everything. So sick. Storm's getting back. Better hurry up, Aloy. Let's go kill these snakes. Made it. Gonna break. I was close. One rickety tower down. On to the next. Okay. I won't be able to make that jump. There is a cable here. Uh... Oh! Uh, well, nowhere to go but up. We are almost up top, dude. We're getting there. Looks like there are massive clamps holding the shuttle in place. I'll bet there's a control console nearby. If we can release we those bad clamps, boys. The shuttle should fall right into the basin. We just gotta hope that it hits all three of the snakes. The machines in my way. Where? We got a bunch of them. Which way is he going? He's gonna turn around if we don't hurry up and get him quick. Let's go. Okay. This guy comes right through here. So if we go around the other side of the rock in this grass, we should be good. We could just straight up shoot him in the face right here, but there's a third one. So we might as well just... If we can get free, easy XP up front, why not? He go. I love it, dude. I just love stealth. Anytime I can use stealth in games, I'm doing it. Let's see where this guy's gonna go. He's gonna turn around. We should just be able to sneak up on him. There she goes. Nice job, Bailey. Okay. Pick up whatever goodies we pass by. Looks like we got another case over here. Probably won't be as thorough with looting later on, but I've, I don't know. Games like this, I always just kind of getting used to it. I really like 
going the extra mile. How are we gonna get up top? Control console might be in there. Use this guy? Okay. Time to crush those machines. It's gonna scare him off, isn't it? We've got two lines to kill. The shuttle's caught up in those cables. We can get it. I'm gonna have to climb the tower to find a way to disconnect them. Of course. I see our answer. With my focus could help here. Shoot. If I pull that beam down, ah. I might drop the access lift. Beautiful. Lift is through. Jump up here. Love the puzzle aspect, man. Kind of like a, a Tomb Raider, almost. Hmm. Okay, the creaking doesn't sound good. I'm gonna have to detach those cables quick. We got this. Let's go, Aloy. Here we go. This should be the right spot. Nicely done. One down. Just need to climb higher. <laughs> Scaling an ancient rickety tower with killer machines waiting down below. That's right. Oh, this back. is so insane. Just a little bit further, Aloy. Swing on over. It looks like we might have to go down. Just drop off. Okay. Run across here. Grab that. It looks like we made it to our final piece. Second cable. She got now please make Make sure you hit him. Um. <laughs> oh, no. Shot, dude, who is this? That's Aloy, baby. Insane. He kind of looks almost still alive. Finishing this the hard way. I need to take this thing down to get to the data center. Okay, where's that weak spot? Weak spot, uh, indestructible. That's detachable. Okay. Oh, jump for that acid. Hit him in those things. Oh my god! Just keep moving. There it is. Okay. 
He's moving around. He's gonna be hard to hit. Nope. There, we got it. Where's Varl at? Varl, you try to, I, I don't know. We gotta hit that thing on the tail. I don't want to get stung with that. Damn it, it broke free. I gotta take this thing down fast. Okay. Maybe hit that tail. Shoot. I tried to dodge in time. Bro, he's all over us. Stand still for one second, sir. Got it. Beautiful. Let me hit that blue spot, or there's the there's the blue things on the front. Beautiful, got one there. He's weak. I'm gonna get up on him. We should be able to finish him off, I think. <laughs> Bro, we're like one hour into the game. And we had a boss fight like that. <laughs> a slither fang. The Just data center should be straight ahead. I guess Paul's gonna have to find another way there. Slayed Medusa. My goodness. Okay, so we're gonna keep moving up to the data center. I think that's a good spot to stop this first episode. Thank you guys so much for watching, dude. I'm I'm so excited for this game, for this series. If you guys are, be sure to drop a like. I'll catch you all later. Peace out.